What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to another video. It's not an actual junk removal video. It's more so uh, what I do during my downtime as far as preventative maintenance, uh, you know, for the dumb trail and truck. Number one thing is cleaning, keeping your equipment clean. Today, we're gonna do a quick, quick video to show you my steps of uh, washing down my dump trailer at the car wash. I think, I think you guys will enjoy this one. Let me give you a, a sneak peek of the dump trailer. It's, it's clean, but uh, Mother Nature added its pollen and, you know, leaves that are falling from the tree. There we go. So, you know, that's what I was, I was just saying that Mother Nature is dropping its leaves. So that's a nice fresh leaf right there. Just look at that. That's a beautiful leaf. So this is a sneak peek of the trailer. As you can see, she's looking good. She's looking real good. And uh, yeah, she's clean. She's got, you know, she's got some pollen on there, but it's looking, it's looking much better, much better than what you guys are about to see in this video. She's looking much better. Yes, sir. I even uh, had some uh, tire shine on here. Yeah, yes, sir clean you see that Ooh. got a little dirt but it's much better than what it was before let me tell you that as a fact so you guys are gonna see my quick process of washing the dump trailer at the car wash the end result on cam doesn't look as good as this again mother nature you know added its pollen and leaves and all the other good stuff that's on there so it doesn't look so sparkling uh, as it does in person uh, but let me tell you it, this thing is clean i needed to have it clean enough uh, for a uh, actual uh, festival uh, activity so you know appearance does matter uh, at certain jobs, okay? You know, if you got like, if you're you're vending, providing trash service for a uh, business function, you know, you want your appearance to look presentable, okay? You don't wanna look messy, you wanna look sloppy, you don't wanna look dirty, you want to look presentable, okay? Because you're gonna have other people looking at you and that other people that are looking at you could be other clients down the line. Your appearance and customer service and your personality is what's going to set you totally different from your competition that it won't be no competition okay your customers ain't gonna think about no competition because they they love working with you so respect your business respect your equipment respect yourself by respecting your physical appearance of your business all right and that's the first thing that they're going to see when you pull up they're going to see your truck and they're going to see your trailer all right then they're going to see you you know so that's another thing we're gonna, uh, you know, work on later on. We're gonna, uh, I'm gonna introduce you guys to um, some uh, merch. Uh, well, not next, not, I wouldn't say necessary merch, but merchandise for my business. Uh, so I got some uniforms coming. Anyway, enjoy the video. Peace. All right, guys, just washed the truck down. It was absolutely filthy. Now we gotta wash down the trailer. Yeah, as you can see, it's she is filthy, absolutely filthy. So uh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get inside the bed because uh, <laughs> the business owners here. So uh, yeah, they're not gonna be uh, too happy if I rinse out the bed of the, the trailer. But I can wash the trailer in my truck. I just can't, you know. They don't really want, you know, this type of like stuff. You don't want it on the ground, which is definitely understandable. So, you know, wash responsibly. It is a business, so I gotta respect the business. And I mean, it's it's anywhere you go. You know, majority of the car washes they don't really like that because when you got cars and stuff that go up in the area, they'll have to drive over all that mud and people don't want to get their you know their shoes and stuff you know muddy so it's understandable you know so uh yeah i'm gonna do my best to wash the outside of the trailer and uh we'll go from there so uh stay tuned stay tuned the first thing i like to do is to pre-soak the trailer kind of loosen up 
the debris. I'll try not to be too hard on it. I mean, it's not just a trailer. That's just how I wash it in general. You always want to pre-soak your Alright, so after I pre soak it, then I'm gonna uh, get the scrub brush and start scrubbing. Uh, as clean as possible, baby. Right, so I raised the trailer up a little bit so that way I can get access to this frame. I like to get all the dirt and stuff that's in the frame I like to clean that up uh, and the reason being is because it you know it, it keeps we're all about keeping that rest away so now we're just gonna take our brush and we're just gonna scrub it down and uh, then rinse it rinse it down afterwards so uh, yeah let me get back to it guys and uh, see you guys when I'm done hitting it with some uh, ceramic wax Add a nice protective layer. My trailer. trailer is clean again I did not do the inside of the bed at least I was able to at least get somewhat clean you know it's not gonna be the perfect you know to have it truly looking clean and shine and I gotta really you know put my elbow grease into it and polish it but you know this is much better than before again it's gonna dry up with streaks and stuff but uh you know I can come back and spray it uh, with some quick detailer wipe it down and get this bad boy looking real good but uh you know it's a dump trailer so i'm not trying to uh try to make too much noise <laughs> if you know what i'm saying so let's go ahead and uh get it lowered back down She's loaded down, so now we can take her home. She's good to go.